Well, every parent knows. You take your eyes off your child for even a second, and this could happen. Fortunately, this child was found hiding in the garbage, but he was spared a much worse fate. Fox 13's Ken Soros joins us with the story and the sanitation worker who rescued that seven-year-old. This is an unbelievable story, Ken. You know, it is, but you know about kids. They will hide any place, any time, including the seven-year-old who lives in a house back there on Neving Street in Tampa. As you said, he hid in a garbage can, and it's amazing that he's still here to talk about it. Elias Quezada has an incredibly inquisitive mind. On Tuesday afternoon, he wondered what it would be like inside a garbage can, so he scampered in. Moments later, the garbage truck arrived. Elias's grandma, who was in the house, heard screams for help. I saw that uh, the, that Elias was on the, the, the wheel. That he had gotten hit? The, yes, that he had gotten had him, uh, being hit or something. Nope. The truck's arm had picked up the can, with Elias still inside, and dumped it into the back. Were you scared? Yes. I felt like I was going to be a mashed potato. The only reason why Elias was not killed is because the driver, Waldo Fidel, checked his surveillance camera in the cab and with lightning speed hit the stop button to stop a deadly blade. He saved a life. What do you think? I think Waldo's a hero. He's still a little shaken. The bad day for me. But their reunion a little while ago was nothing but smiles. It seems like Elias has learned his lesson. Well, maybe. Unless it's like a tiny cat trash can that's inside the house, then it might be fine. But never again in one like this. Now, Waste Connections, which picks up the garbage in Hillsborough County, tells me that all the drivers are trained every single time, with no exception, to look at that camera before they activate anything. And thank goodness, in this case, he actually did. Yeah, you would never think that something like that would happen, and yet it did, right? <laughs> That's what it's for. Thanks, Ken. Yeah.